Previously on Part Time Gamer Dad. Alright, are you. Is it my flashlight that you're seeing? Uh. Uh. I, 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 oh no! It's the most time to play that he's ever had. He's a part-time gamer dad. Okay, we made it into the base. I've been walking around for a minute, and let's... This, this door looks important, so let's see what's going on with this. This is either going to be really good for me or really bad. A, a big old door like this can only mean one of two things. Right. Open sesame! It's like I'm entering Scrooge McDuck's money pit. Okay. Nope! Very bad for me! Gonna run away immediately! It didn't come charging after me. I... Oh, no. It is moving, though. It is... Oh, no! No, no, no! Close it up! Close it up! Woo. Didn't like how that thing walked around. Not... Oh, it can walk through doors! It, it, clever girl. Uh, oh. Are you a door switch? You're a light switch. I'm moving so slow. Oh, 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 you're pretty. You're pretty. You had such a cute little, mm. It's you're, you're like an adorable Zoidberg. Okay, I'm hobbled. Is the thing still walking around? Yes, but it's not in the door that it came from, is it? We can go through here now. Can I close you? You seem very secure. Nope, can't close you. How was I supposed to avoid that? Was that just supposed to happen? That was a unique death animation. Oh, I gotta wait for you. Wait. I should have thought twice before doing that. Am I letting another one out? I hope not. Where's my new friend? Does he even know where I am? Vision seems to be okay. Still opening, still opening. Anybody? Nope, I'm starting to get a little glitchy. I saw a map that said I had to go through like the crew quarters in order to get where the uh, Ark is stored. Which means I'm probably gonna have to go through some terrible things. Okay. All right, things have calmed down. Things have calmed down. Not me, I have not calmed down, but things have calmed down just a little bit. Don't think I can take my time, though. I think I'm still being stalked. Kind of begs the question, what did that thing do to me whenever it caught me with its little waggly face? Uh-oh! Did it find me? Yep. It can do doors. Does that mean it can do ladders? I feel like I'm being chased. This feels very much like a chase sequence. Can't go there. Can't go there. Man, this body is slow. Are you a door that closes? Yes, you are. Won't hold my new friend for long. Friends? Oh, Poner! Point of no return. What was I saying? No, he caught me with his little waggly face. That was a, a unique, unique animation. It wasn't the normal death animation. So I'm wondering if that was kind of supposed to happen. Where am I going? Oh, here we go, living quarters. Just blindly charging through doors. Uh, close them up. There. There, nothing terrible can happen in the crew quarters. Ugh. What are we, like 24 episodes in? I still am not making a better noise whenever I shove my little hand in there. Oop! Well, you're done for good. Uh, sure. If, if the button has smoke coming out of it, that's good, right? What? Who? Who? Where? Okay, well, I have a little buddy helping me along here. That'll make things more interesting. Just taking inventory of what I can do and what I can't do. You're, you're, you're gonna have to communicate with me in a bit more of a 
of a better way than just sort of whispering things into my brain. Oh, hi. You're a terrible monstrosity covered in a blanket. Wanna be friends? You don't seem to be hostile, at least. We're just gonna ignore how horrifying this is. Oh, there's two of you. You have a bunk mate. Hi. Okay, we're, we're leaving. We're leaving. Uh, gonna take this. You clearly don't need it. I'm, I'm prepared to pillow womp anything that comes my way. Anything walks up, I'm just gonna give him a good womp. Good pillow womp. Womp. Move on, Simon. What? Move on, Simon? <gasps> he knows my name. Oh, look. A regular human. As far as we know. Hmm. What's in your brain hole? Can we do anything for him? No. We're out of sedatives. If we had a gun, this would be the time to pull it out. Wish I had a gun! I not expected it to end like this. Should have jumped the climber back to Omicron. Without the Ark? Forget about the Ark. No, you don't get to say that. It's the only thing left of value. You know that. Yeah, yeah. Promise I don't know who these people behind. are, by the way. We'll all be dead one day. Then what? Well, better keep it safe until then. Don't want the wild to take and swallow it whole. Uh, I'm sorry, Catherine. It's okay, Ian. Just let it out. Let it all out. You know, he brings up a good point. We haven't heard from Catherine in a while. Not since we left the climber. And I haven't exactly found a good spot to slaughter into. Uh, hi, what are you? The what? Oh, that's not creepy at all. You're not creepy at all. You like creepy stuff. I'm out of here. Okay, so here's the problem, is I sort of forgot... Dude, it's a chatty game. Such a chatty game. I'm trying to play here. I forgot where I came in. I'm so used to games being handholdy and giving me a map and stuff. Uh, because I live in the map screen for other games. Anyone who's been watching my Iconoclast playthrough will will know that I spend a lot of time in the map. Okay. Dude, I'm trying! You've got to be patient, though. Man. All right, infirmary. Seems like a good safe spot. Up, up, up we go! You're locked. Okay. Go away, Rob. Well, I'm letting you or your stupid pets inside. <gasps> There's someone in here. But I'm not a pet. Let me in. I can talk to you, can't I? Nothing. All right. I'm coming back for you. <sighs> This game does have distinct phases, right? Like this is the wander the corridors until we get an objective. Then we find our objective, and on route to that objective, the threats get worse. So this is the the subtle ramping up. Each one of these stations is kind of like a little mini game unto itself, which I can appreciate the structure. All right, more bedrooms. Show feet, please. Oh, I wish I hadn't turned that on. What do we got here? He's a handsome boy. Look, I get that you are probably in a never-ending uh, life 
artificially extended by pain and suffering, but you look hella cool. Right, what about your friend? Why'd you get all jacked up and your friend didn't? What the fuck did we do? Hey, try not to think about it. My whole life, I've been a good man. We messed up, Sarah. There, there. Okay. What are you hanging on to? More photos. Catherine! Okay, I, I would make a wry remark, but uh, that actually kind of raises a few questions here. Catherine's been a little evasive on her life underwater, and it kind of sounds like she really didn't get along with, with anybody down here. But if somebody it was in their, their death throes while holding on to half of a picture, not even a full picture, a picture that's been ripped in half, then that's very telling. I'm also fully prepared for all of these things to spring to life and start chasing me at any given moment, by the way. Communicate with you. Nope, sure can't. Alright, well, you stay put. You? You're like some kind of hideous caterpillar monster. Soon to turn into a beautiful butterfly, I'm sure. I think I've made the rounds. Dispatch. Sounds important. Such a teeny office. Did it really necessitate its own little walkway? All right. Let's see. Wait. Cool. That makes no sense to me. All right. Transmission. Upsilon. Offline. Theta. Offline. Lambda. Offline. Delta. Offline. Omicron. Offline. Phi. Offline. Omega. Libsyn. Okay, not even connected to those. Alright, well this Herber fella had a lot on their mind. Door locks! Good, exactly what I need. I want the infirmary unlocked. Yes. Can I just unlock all of them? Oh, need a code for that one. Okay. Time to go see another actual human being. Hopefully. Dive room, not interested. Infirmary, here we go. If nothing else, hopefully we can find a spot to talk to Catherine. I'd like to get her input on this. Hello? Oh! You are an actual human! You... You're... different. Yeah, you could say that. Go ahead. Make yourself at home. I would! It's so cozy in here. I'm sure it smells wonderful, too. So what's your deal? Don't mind me. Can I help you with anything? Well, well, I don't like the looks of that big fat disable button sitting right there on your life support machine. Are Let's have a chit chat. Sarah Lindwall. Hi, Sarah. Payload technician at your service. Simon, all robotic right, monstrosity. Simon, all right? I'd say so. You're the first normal living human I've seen. There's not many left down here. Most okay. of them are up on the plateau. You mean at Omicron? 
Yeah. Mm, there's no one I alive. I got bad news for you, Sarah. You've been there? I've been all over. The power plant at Upsilon. The ruins of Lambda. The abandoned Delta. Theta. You've been to Theta? There's not a lot left of Pathos too. And uh, I'm the only living person you've met. <coughs> you mean I'm the you last win. living human on the planet? You win! You win humanity! Sorry. Who are you again? Simon Jarrett. Stationed at? Nowhere. I, I used to work in a bookshop in Toronto. Long story. Then what the hell are you doing here? I'm trying to find the okay. Ark. Why you're, would you? It's fine How if you're upset. How do you know upset. about that? I've heard it's the last you're hope for mankind. Me. Damn right it is. Now what do you want with it? Take it to the Man, gun at five. Cranky. Launch it into space. That was the plan, all right. I've been guarding it ever since we brought it back to Tau. She is the guardian. I bring myself to let go. I'll tell you the truth. I don't have the strength to argue. And I certainly don't have the time to wait for the next sentient thing shuffling through here. Go ahead. Take it. Thank you. Beep boop. Get you anything? Do anything for you? You could kill me. Yeah, there it is. I knew Good we were heading in that direction. Off. Good to get this over with. I still can't believe I'm the last one. It's crazy. Yeah, we'll get you a trophy. Uh, about if the I whole killing you thing. I would clean this place up a little bit. No, haha. -ha. I'm sure you would have made it look lovely. What are you eating? How are you surviving? Can I plug in Catherine? You two can have a little chit chat? Okay, there's plenty of lore over here. Okay, do you have any anything more to say? I'm actually fascinated with you. Are you serious about me killing you? No. I Love to hang around here until I dry up to the size of a raisin. Ooh. Simon, this fucking sucks. <coughs> I don't want to live like this. Why are you living like this? Why are you sick? What's going on with you? I mean, granted, you're malnourished. Uh, that's plainly evident. Because Lord knows what it is you've been eating to survive here. Those dirty dishes? Looks like it. I can only imagine the smell in here. It probably smells terrible. And this is the Ark, huh? It's such a little thing. All right, well, let's have a chit chat. Shouldn't we be doing something to keep you alive? Why? You're the last human. I, I just find it disrespectful to our entire history not to fight this. Sure, we have the Ark, but you're the real deal. Thanks. That's probably the best compliment I've ever got. But the truth is... You haven't received a lot of compliments then, ma'am. The Ark is all we have. We'll have to accept second best. You know? This is actually a really cool moment. This feels right. Son, I want to die. Sarah. Just think about it. All right. Um... Like, I, I know we just met and have only been talking for a few minutes, but honestly, the gravity of the situation does not feel shoehorned in at all. This feels like a very genuine thing. She's She's definitely happy to see that I'm sentient and not like some horrible beast and she's plainly glad to have someone to talk to. It's probably been driving her nuts being held up in this room this whole time with only like horrible things apparently pounding at the door because that's what she thought I was, which means it's happened before I arrived. And this is another one of those things where death is seen as a release. I'm not quite decided yet. Be Let's see what's guess. going on here. I got no secrets worth keeping. Alright. Dispatch. Offline. Everything's offline!
Door locks! Oh! Oh! Hi! Is that the code? Well, thank you, helpful ghost in the machine. That won't come back to bite me in any way. Sarah, what do you have on your workstation? Okay, that one looks like it was made by AI, for real. Recent documents. Heck yeah, restore those. Okay, here we go. Emergency food. A uh, thorough look at what common chemicals and compounds found at Pathos 2 could keep you alive in emergency situations. A manual on how to keep unconscious or comatose colleagues fed through intravenous drip. Last access by Sarah Lindwall. Post, blah, 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 blah. Methods on how to make room for additional payload after the casing has been constructed and left Delta. Less access by Catherine Chun. Okay, emergency food and nutrition. That certainly makes sense. Uh, Catherine apparently was hanging out here at one point. Do you have anything to add to that? Don't let me down. Okay. Beatles fan, are we? Alright, and you have some lore. <laughs> no, I don't want to do that. I want to look at some of these documents. Someone's just been dreaming of nature, which, again... Hard to blame. If you're stuck in these, you know, gun metal and beige, uh, you know, temples to insanity under the sea, and apparently the entire surface world is destroyed, well, yeah, I'd be a little reminiscent of nice, lush, green places. All right. Well, we found the Ark, and we have a decision to make about Sarah, which we will do next time on Part-Time Gamer Dad. In the meantime, thank you all so much for watching. Do the YouTube things. Leave a comment. Subscribe if you haven't. Maybe give me a little thumbs up. Bye.